PlayStation something. Wow. This, um, oh, yeah. Ray-Bans. All right, hundred fifty dollars. Brand new golf clubs. It's, I was banking on half these boxes being empty, but this is a burner, deep fryer, clothes. What we got Coogie. I still don't know how to say that. I keep finding that clothes, jerseys, a lot of sports stuff. That's looking full. Shoes, what do we got? M gear, these are work boots. PlayStation something. Wow. Nope. No PlayStation. Brand new golf clubs. Somewhat empty. What the hell? Okay. Clothes, shoes. Levi's. Gold size Nikes. There we go. There's the other work boot. Adidas. One Nike. Supplement empty box. Alright. I'm gonna dig through it, take a little bit home, and come back tomorrow, pick up the rest. Alright, started sorting. I'm just gonna toss clothes and there's a couple hats. Some I think Everlast. What brand is this? Everlast gloves. Um Bunch of empty shoe boxes. Starting to collect the shoes, so I haven't looked any of these up. These are probably worth a buck. They're all pretty big size. That's 13, not bad. I've had 15s before and they're really hard to sell. Um, Levi's, Under Armour, Adidas, and then this one actually has shoes in it. Puma, Roma. Kind of cool. Use, but they got the box. So. Awesome. And then there's some, oh yeah, Ray-Bans, Nike, I didn't know Nike made glasses, but it makes sense, Oakley, hell yeah, Charles Raymond, that's pretty rusty, he's probably not worth much, alright, let me dig back through this box, alright, just went through this one, this is the more formal stuff on hangers, got a couple pairs of jeans, I'll have to look at the shirts and ties at home. Uh, this is made in Korea, so that might be a wolf suit or something. This, there's some vintage in here for sure. Smash, I don't know that brand. Button up. Yeah, not bad. A couple bucks. Alright, with COVID I've been seeing a lot of these in photos, but not in lockers that I've been buying. So i got a whole case of hand sanitizer here. So... Won't be needing to buy any of this for a while. All right, I'm coming back with a van for it, but I'm gonna load up uh, golf clubs and these shoes in the car. And probably have maybe a couple hundred dollars of clothes and almost the rest is gonna be trash. There's some books in here I'm gonna sort through, some miscellaneous DVDs, but I'll, majority trash, maybe a couple things to get to the uh, thrift store. Might have 75 bucks worth of weights here, give or take. Uh, what do we got, 10? 20, no, those are five pound plates. All right, we'll see. I'll add it up. Um, I checked that box, I didn't record it. That's just filled with like uh, cable receivers. So it's like dish um, network stuff. And then we got two of these um, deep fryers for outdoors, so not bad. All right, so from that locker we paid $150 for. Um, took a couple items home. Most of them I listed last night. Just give a quick breakdown. Um, to see where we're at in the profit. Already sold one item, um, sent an offer out for another one. So let's start tallying it up. So of the ones that got listed last night, these, um, what are these? The Levi Strauss shoes, size 13. Those sold, I took an offer for $28. I didn't even have a model name for them, which is why I was more motivated to take the first offer. If I knew the model and knew the sell-through, I'd probably wait a little bit more, but there was no sell-through on them, so... 28 is not a bad deal. I had them listed for 40. Um, first up, um, these Pumas listed for 40 bucks. Next, we have the Nike Zoom Hyperfuse, 50 bucks. I think I've actually sold a size 15 pair of these before, um, or I still have them on the shelf. We'll see. 
um, 35 for these running shoes. These are size 14 or 15. Then we've got those Under Armour boots are listed at 55. And then just mentioned Levi Strauss. These are work boots, these mountain gear. Those are listed for 40. And last but not least, these other running shoes, Adidas, are listed at $35. So I'll total those up, um, see where we're at getting into the profit. So 150 bucks, we listed at least 150 here. Um, but probably take that in half for expectation in terms of sell through and taking offers. Also, I got the golf clubs, probably 50 to 100 bucks for those if I decide to sell those locally. All right, so a couple more things from the locker. I actually ended up finding the full pair. I thought I had just had one. So these are, I thought that's what they, I thought they were. They're basically Nike ACG water shoes. They call them aqua socks. I thought they were inserts, but they're not. Uh, so this particular model is nothing on the internet for it. Uh, there's very similar ones. Um, there was one on Grail that went for over a hundred bucks new, like 150 or something crazy. Um, pretty basic and go figure, it's probably not too many people keeping them for 10 plus years. They're from 2008. Um, went ahead and just listed them on eBay for a hundred bucks. Um, best offer. So even if I got half of that, 50 bucks would be amazing, but, uh, unique little, little thing. It'll probably sit on the shelf for a little while. And then, uh, in total, I ended up finding, I think I recorded some of these in the locker, uh, four different frames. These are Oakley's. Um, let me pull up how much I got for them. Da, 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 da. So the Oakley's I got, uh, I'm listing for 45 best offer. So I found a lot of sunglasses and lockers, but not many uh, eyeglass frames, let alone designer. So 45 best offer. Uh, the Ray-Bans are a little bit more beat up um, scratch wise. So these ones, uh, 35 best offer. Um, so all these prescription lenses, I sell a lot of uh, eyeglasses, just not from lockers. I get them from thrift stores. Um, basically, you pop out these so you don't have to worry about them being scratched because these are somebody's prescription. Put your own in, and people are just buying the frame. So uh, 30 best offer for these Nikes. Uh, the frames are actually excellent condition. The um, lens could be in better shape, but again, who cares? So these have no, as you can see, no lens in them at all. These are Dolce & Gabbana. However, they are made in China, not made in Italy. So I put these up for 25 best offer. Um, so all in all, we're looking at 70, 80, 110, 135 best offer. So again, just grinding out the little profits. All it takes is getting about half of what I'm asking and it's some solid profit from this locker. All right, I'm back. The sun's killing me, let me move. Um, all right, so I got the, the U-Haul back to the locker, paid 154, uh, I already started Sorting through some stuff, so let's get a quick preview of what I found so far and what I sorted out. Alright, so I emptied a couple of these big wardrobe boxes, so I'm going to break this down. This is empty now. These three are trash, mostly bedding, hangers. Bedding's always ridiculous. A bunch of toiletries there. Um, this is the first trash bag. And then we've got, this is all donate stuff, uh, with the exception of these frames. I'll probably pop the other ones out because that looks really bad. A lot of fake DVDs. There's nothing in that PS3, um, but because I still have all this stuff to sort, I set it there just in case I find the game. Um, so a quick preview of the money so far. Adidas Windbreaker. I need to learn how to say this. Kugi, Kuji, whatever. Um, denim jacket. I gotta find the year on this, but it's a Reebok Redskins jacket. White, super cool. Um, Shine Unlimited collection, really awesome. I had to throw away another one because it was completely trashed leather. Um, just a couple button ups, these are all like size 3XL, two denim jackets, so those should get a couple bucks after I wash them. And then let's get back into what we got. All right, that's a wrap on this locker. I'm gonna get this organized in the truck. Everything you're looking at here is trash. Gotta get that cleaned up. A lot of these boxes just need to be broken down. That is donate. Bottom one's empty. Top one is the only stuff I'm keeping. Mostly clothes, a couple th small things. Um, this is actually kind of cool. It's a Redskins uh, tie, necktie with tags still. Um, all this is empty. That's probably gonna get donated. Um, and then load up the 
the weights that are hiding there. Some more trash there. Empty, 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 empty. Loaded up. Most of it's trash. Those bins will come in handy for closed sorting. And we are empty. See you on the next one.